Hello gamers, this is Wintermute here. So here we are on the Lunar Base Alpha once again. Um, I should note there's some some differences uh, with the Moon Base. It's basically like another eight levels uh, set on the Moon. This is the first of the eight. Uh, and upgrades, automobiles, I'm assuming planes, I haven't got there yet, but everything costs a thousand times more than it did on the first eight levels. So it means that these these go very, very slowly. So I ended up doing a prestige uh, kind of on the second moon base level, which I guess is technically level 10. I'll show that a bit later in this video, but as we'll see, prices are really, so the third lot costs 68 million, which is super expensive, especially when you're only making 1500 coins a second. Yeah, that's even with prestige, 463% uh, increase from prestige. So it takes a long, long time. So if you're patient, uh, <laughs> the moon base is for you. It looks cool. I'll, I'll, get, I'll give you that. I have a feeling the game developers did this because if you'll notice, if you play the first, or level 8, if you play level 8 on a phone that's not super fast, it gets really laggy just because there's so many lots and so much activity going on. So I think this was their idea of continuing the gameplay without just adding more lots and more, you know, more cars and more, more of everything. So I couldn't even do a bank upgrade um, or get my third lot built, so I kind of played for a little bit here and then ended up just uh, letting the game sit overnight. Not playing, not just not idling, but just like turning it off. And then I think I had enough money the next day to build my third and fourth lot. So I think I'll skip ahead here. Do that. Actually, not yet. Actually, I do it in a, I do it in a few minutes. Um, I ended up using some of my uh, bucks, the secondary currency, just to push some of these levels along, like uh, level my buildings a bit quicker, just to try to increase the income so I could get the third, third lot built. But everything was just so expensive that I had to let it go overnight. Uh, you'll notice that the the names of the upgrades have changed, and I think that the upgrades themselves are, they do the exact same thing as they did in the first eight levels. So all they've done is just change the name to kind of tailor them to a, a moon-based kind of atmosphere, or lack of atmosphere. Speed things up about 10 times here, just because it was pretty slow going. But all I did was use bucks to kind of speed level these buildings, and to, you know, get any coin bonuses that I could, do any upgrades that I could. It's the same strategy as the first eight levels, but... And then I let the game set overnight and built a couple more lots. So here I am with all four lots built and I'm ready to proceed on to level 10. I can't even afford too many of the bank upgrades though. I would have liked to have done more, but too expensive. You also notice I have one of the kind of quests, build 10,000 buildings. I think I was like 4,000 into that, but it's going to take a while for me to get to that. So here we are in level 9, an expanded bigger version of the moon base. It's essentially the same as level 2, but with the kind of the moon art. and they upgrade their name differently, but the prices are super expensive still. So your first lot is two million, and your second lot is six million, and your third lot is 68 million, or 69 million pretty much. And then you're pretty much kind of out of money. <laughs> the fourth one's 208 million. So at 10,000 coins a second, it's going to take a while to get to 208 million. So 
So I ended up kind of doing as much as I could here. Um, I kind of didn't want to idle overnight, and I had 1,460 prestige keys kind of ready to go. So I ended up doing a prestige because it was just going to take too long to get to level 3, or moon level 3 I should say, which is a level 11. But it's pretty much the same. I'd be curious to hear your thoughts about how you feel about kind of the speed of the game at this point, whether you find it kind of too painfully slow or whether you still find it fun, just leave a comment. And maybe if you're doing anything special or trying other building types, please let me know in the comments. Here I've sped things up again ten times, just because it was the same kind of thing over and over. I do recommend kind of saving up your bucks for these levels so that you can use use some of them to power your way through. So yeah, even after all that, it's still only 103 million coins and it's going to cost 207 million to advance. I probably shouldn't have kind of thrown in the towel so to speak, too early here. I probably should have just let the game run overnight and uh, try to get to level the third moon level, but it was too going to be too long. And I, I kind of wanted to actively play again, so that's why I prestiged. So everything past this point is kind of the same, and it's covered in my first video. So I just sped things up ten times. And I think I went up to level 4. So let's sit back and enjoy level 1 through 4 at top speed. One little tip. Uh, probably obvious but it might not be. When you're doing your upgrades you don't have to click kind of each time to go through the upgrades. You can just hold down tap, like hold down your press and it'll just go through all the upgrades. always uh, play at a slower speed on YouTube to see if you want to see how I do things. But it's pretty much as the same as the first time through. I take this up to level 4 and then that'll be the end of the video. And I probably won't make a video about level 5 all the way through to Moon Base 2 again. And I'll start with uh, the second level, the, sec the second Moon Base, also known as level 10, in my next video. So. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'd love to hear your thoughts on the game in the comments.